Hello, on today's episode of Jeannie's Kitchen Counter, I'm going to show you how to make pumpkin bread. Now, I do have to go ahead and throw a shout out to one of my friends because no one loves pumpkin bread more than he. Eric, this episode is for you. All right, let's go ahead and show you how to make pumpkin bread. Let's go over all the ingredients. Now, you're going to need one and a half cups of all-purpose flour. You're going to need a half a teaspoon of baking soda, a quarter teaspoon of baking powder, a quarter teaspoon of salt, and a tablespoon of pumpkin pie spice. You're also going to need one and a half cups of regular granulated sugar. You're also going to need one and a half cups of pure pumpkin puree, one tablespoon of vanilla extract, one stick of unsalted room temperature butter, and two eggs. Okay, now you have two separate bowls here, one bowl with your dry ingredients and one bowl with your wet ingredients. Now in your dry ingredient bowl, you're gonna go ahead and throw in everything in there. So you have your flour, your baking powder, your salt, your pumpkin pie spice, your baking soda. And let's just go ahead and mix that together real quick. Now your wet ingredients, your pumpkin pie puree, just have it in a separate little bowl. Throw in the vanilla extract. Throw in the butter. And throw in your eggs. Just mix that together. Nice and easy, just get it in there. Takes about a minute or two just to get it in there. Now the only dry ingredient that we have left to the side is the sugar. We're going to go ahead and put the sugar in with the... Just mix that in. This is going to be so delicious. It's going to be nice and moist because nothing's worse than having dry bread. Dry pumpkin bread just isn't any good. Okay, we have that all incorporated. Now let's go ahead and mix the wet ingredients with the dry ingredients. You want to make sure you get everything, okay? Get it all in. Goodness. We're just going to mix it all together. Now don't forget to go ahead and grease your loaf pan and line the bottom with parchment paper. So it's nice and easy for you when you're ready to take the bread out. Alright, looks good on my end. Now let's just go ahead and get it into the loaf pan. Now we're going to put this into the oven, 350 degrees, for 55 to 60 minutes. And then we're gonna let it cool for about 10 to 15 minutes before we break into it. Okay. It looks and smells good. We'll just go ahead and spread it out. All right. Into the oven this goes for 55 to 60 minutes on 350. I'll see you soon. All right, pumpkin bread was in the oven for exactly 60 minutes and this is what it looks like. Look how pretty. Now what we're gonna do is go ahead and cut a slice and see how it turned out on the inside. It's beautiful. Perfectly cooked, still nice and warm. Now let's go ahead, I like to have mine with a little bit of butter. So let's go ahead and put a little bit of butter and then let's taste it. Absolutely perfect. Enjoy it. 